Bangalore, known as the Silicon Valley of India, is a well-known cultural and economic hub. A study conducted to map the socio-economic conditions of construction workers in Bangalore projected that 86% of the workers were male. Despite it being a job creation engine for people from the economically weaker section of society, the basic working conditions of construction workers have been long ignored. The existing housing facilities are cramped, lack privacy, and less than 25% of the accommodations have access to electricity. There is a lack of basic amenities, proper accommodation, access to sanitation, social interaction, and health care. Our project Valise is on construction workers' housing for Chitrakuta School, accommodating 120 laborers, at Nagarbhavi, Bangalore. Our site area is 1,100 square meters and proposed built-up area is 615 square meters. The project aims to create a healthy living environment that would serve as a temporary shelter for the construction workers. The units are designed to be foldable and compact. The core prototype is a 3 meters by 3 meters module. The second and third prototypes are formed by simply removing a shared wall. Family units and shared dormitories are designed as independent blocks on the site. Materials with high thermal resistance were chosen, such as Enviro board, mod roof, and plywood flooring. This project included amenities like a community kitchen, common dining, and a clinic. Modular structures are easy to dismantle, which saves construction time and results in zero construction waste. The construction worker housing site extends from east to west. The blocks are arranged in such a way that the longer facades face the north-south direction. As a result, heat intake from the direct sun is reduced in the east and west directions. The block corridors extend into the interaction zones, boosting socialization. This contributes to the mental and physical well-being of construction workers. The creche and children's play area are located in the center for better supervision and security. This construction is designed to be foldable for ease of handling and transportation. Through the Palafete Foundation, the units are elevated by 0.6 meters from the ground level. This helps to minimize the impact on the current site while also providing protection in the event of a flood. The solar bottle tube light is made of an empty 1.5 liter plastic bottle with liquid bleach and purified water. Rainwater collected at the site level is filtered through a biochar system. For domestic use, rain gardens are specially designed garden beds that collect and filter storm water runoff from the site. Excess rainwater is recharged groundwater through specially constructed recharge wells, called ground recharging. To reduce the amount of water used for flushing, eco toilets are designed, also known as dry toilets, where waste is composted.